I'm really disappointed here because I work there. Not the scandals. So I've been going to a lot of be my first recipe. A little bit like crying. I don't know anything. The best tahini I've ever ate. You. It didn't go as well as I wanted. Yeah. Such random thought at 7.20 a.m. on my rest day, watching 10 Mojo's vlog. She's such a random but such a cool YouTuber, even though she says so much BS and does so much BS. I just can't not watch her videos. Like, she's an iconic queen. Am I right? I am. I love how she doesn't care what other people think about her. I would love that. Not the scandals, though. Not the scandals. <laughs> I've been feeling so, I've been feeling so down, yeah Can you tell me why, can you tell me why I'm down, yeah No friends of mine, no friends of mine around. What a surprise, I'm going on a hike again Again, with my mom And I love hiking, I really do But I get pissed off easily <laughs> And I get annoyed easily Because my mom walks so slow And I can't I just get so frustrated by walking so slow for me, for my pace, it is slow. Even though I've been here, of course I love it, it's just hard to walk slow. But overall it was great, because the weather was pretty great, finally, because obviously it's summer, still can't believe that, and also, do I have summer vibes? Not yet, not yet, unfortunately, well, hopefully soon, fingers crossed. I finally got my last my protein package, even though this was the first one I ordered. But I, I guess they uh, ship from different headquarters, different storage rooms from Poland, because that's from where it comes from to Latvia. So yeah, got the protein bars, finally. And yeah, going home after my walk, no, hike, hike, not a walk. 13 kilometers isn't a walk. I got one pack of these carb crushers chocolate orange because they were the cheapest flavor out there and 15 grams of protein can you tell that I have a, a problem obsession and this is not even everything behind here is another soy protein isolate a ah, sugar-free syrup baked wait baked cookies my favorite baked cookies Two protein powders that I haven't tried yet, coffee and walnut and that, that was vanilla. These, that taste incredible. And probably something else, probably something else. So last year I messaged my protein and they said you have to have 5K to be an affiliate. This year I messaged and they said 10K. Great, well, it's not great at all. So go follow me on Instagram and hit that subscribe button and follow me everywhere. So I would stop spending all my money on my protein products and be an affiliate and be able to give a code to you who's watching this. Because clearly I have a long way to go, sadly. So I forgot to film everything at the gym, but this is my usual breakfast. Soy chunks, uh, half of the, half, basically 50 grams grams of soy chunks are 25 grams of protein greens uh and uh, buckwheat and vegan mayo and i added also this ketchup and uh, tomato and it just tastes amazing but me with my dad we went here and uh, we walked for like an hour and a half it was finally a warm day and then well this happened yeah you see those scissors well, basically, I can't get to the dresser, hairdresser, and I asked my mom to chop it. Chop it off. Chop it off. And let me just tell you, it didn't go as well as I wanted it to go, sadly. This was my live action, reaction, like actual 
live I, I didn't check it because i was too scared but i haven't had this short hair in years in years and you can see how kind of frustrated frustrated a lot really frustrated i was just look at my face better don't i mean it's not that bad right it is i just spent like 15 minutes cutting the fronts because basically they were like this but like yeah that happens when you, your mom cuts it for the first time in my life but we're doing we were doing this just because the hair dresser where i where you where i usually go to she isn't able to just take me because she's really busy and i can't uh, really go anywhere else because where i go i get it for free because uh, i know that person and i'm not going to spend 20 euros or something to just cut <laughs> normally so yeah that's me a little bit like crying because bye bye 20 centimeters of my hair and then for dinner my mom made a new recipe because i asked her i didn't make it my mom made it <laughs> usually new recipes she makes it for me thank you mom but it was lentil cream soup i love creamy soups and i decided to eat some pickles and like pickled something vegan sausage and one bread to dip it into it i don't know why in these clips the cream soup looks kind of a weird color but actually it was incredible Look what my mom made, rhubarb compote. I love rhubarb compote. I love compote so much. So my first real experience is like uh, actually trying to, not like work, but trying how it's going to be working there. Uh, and it was pretty okay. I mean, the way I practiced for two hours from 10 to 12, and not gonna lie, after two those two hours, my legs were tired already by standing. I needed to do some small things, small works, nothing like extremely huge, obviously, because I don't know anything. I don't know if I'm going to go work there or on that other place as a chef's help, not here, not there where I went today, but I don't know. I don't know, I'm like, I don't know anything. Yeah. I just got a new package from VP Lab Vegan Protein. They sent it to me, so I will make a recipe for them. And this is chocolate flavor. I was hoping this will be chocolate. I was like, fingers crossed, and it is. And also the shaker, I've never used. And I don't drink like protein shakes. I use protein in food, so, but I will use it somehow. But this, I don't know what I'm going to do with it, but I will use it. So yeah, I'm going to make a recipe really soon. It's kind of scary but i've been going to a lot of job interviews i don't really want to work because my dream is to be a full-time content creator or P pt but i can't get my personal training course if i haven't finished high school so i've been going to a lot of job interviews and on wednesday i'm going to have a practice like be a practicant kind of in my favorite vegan restaurant and i'm really excited nervous I've never actually really worked anywhere like full time kind of thing. So we'll see how it's going to go. I don't know if I will be able to film anything. Probably not because I'm going to be needing to work, especially my first day, right? So that was crazy. I went today to two job interviews. Another was in another place. I don't know where I'm going to work because I don't know how I'm going to like it working in um, kind of as a chef's health helper in uh, like making when you're making food so i don't know how it's going to go but yeah that's a little update about me and my life and a great ice cream too okay the texture looks pretty great pretty smooth as you can see this is my creation for the recipe my first recipe the second recipe is going to be a lot different but this one oh, 
I already tried it. Spoiler alert. And here's a little mess over here. Actually, I kind of like this protein. Chocolate protein. So yeah, that's my <laughs> messiness. What my mom got from the work to me. All vegan. Uh, I don't know when I'm going to eat it. So this was sunflower seed butter. This was pumpkin uh, protein. Pumpkin protein probably won't, won't taste great, but pumpkin protein didn't even know that existed. This is kind of sausage that was granola. That, that, that was like kind of sausage, sausage you can make. This, the best the tahini I've ever ate. It doesn't even taste like tahini. These fudges, banana fudges, amazing. Avocado kind of butter, avocado spread, this. Cashew butter. Oh, some sort of liquid sweetener Molasse. I don't like molasse Molasses, I don't know how to pronounce it and this is the box I already have of the food that I have got that my mom has brought and more food I don't know when I'm going to eat it all of that This morning I filmed a video for a different uh, video <laughs> basically but my workout was by one person who I followed and uh, you'll see it later in this month or I don't know when I'm going to post this video but um, the, uh, spoiler alert it was a killer one definitely my quads are a little sore the next day where I was sweating uh, spoiler alert dripping in a lot of sweat but um, I really enjoyed it I really enjoyed it even though I'm not a fan of leg days because they are they're mentally and physically really, really hard. But you have to push through the pain to see growth and to grow as a person or to get, your, to get you where you want to be, for your goals, for where you want to be in life. You have to work. And this is what I did. I worked some of the clips, of course, not a lot of clips. Only like a few clips that I was able to film because... I need to work, right? Not film videos on YouTube, but I will film my dinners, I will film my food. Because I don't know, I love just like filming pretty food, even though I never really make extremely aesthetic meals. Well, that's basically maybe why. Why I like doing it. So, my day one overall feelings about the work, I think I will work there. It was better than the first where I was like kind of helping as a bartender. I was I would needed to do like small small things, small like works, nothing like make food like actual because obviously I don't know the recipes or things like that what you must include in salads or whatever. But I was like helping for small things and I was also able to go home faster, not work till 9 p.m. But like till 7.45, so that was great. But next day I have to go to, is um, on Friday and Saturday, those are going to be busy days. Because Friday, Saturday, people start going out, people start doing things. So yeah, it's going to be a lot more busier, but I'm so excited to try new food. <laughs> not new food, all of the recipes, all of them um meals on the menu because i work there and i'm able to do it so that's really great so that's not officially yet but hopefully i will officially so that's my first impression about my first work uh and yeah it was like a lot of standing it wasn't a lot of like walking walking because i'm not a bartender so those are my first impressions morning i slept so bad right now i'm going to the bu bus station to go to the gym but like morning voice slept horrible couldn't fall asleep and i haven't decided where i'm going to train today because i'm going to the other gym and i didn't want to go this week i didn't because i don't really like it there that much as my main gym so ugh. Like day, yes, another like day because plan switch <laughs> wasn't the best, wasn't great. I literally wasted 10 minutes at the start. I was sitting up for hip thrust in the other gym, 
because on my main gyms uh, they're doing some reconstruction, some sort of work and yeah, I went to the other gym. I haven't done hip thrust on that other gym and the plates there are smaller and different. The, the benches are different and I couldn't lift the weight because it, the, the bar with the weight was too low. I don't know how to explain it. I was so frustrated, so annoyed. The workout was so random, so I will have to do on Saturday hip thrust. I did bench instead, but still, it was like meh and I'm like so sad that it wasn't the best leg day. Because yesterday's leg day was fire, but I guess that's always happens with me. After something good, something bad. I'm today trying out a new protein powder, pea protein isolate in coffee and walnut. It smells really great, but I just tasted it. It tastes like nothing. It tastes chalky and meh. Like literally don't recommend it at all. Where the taste? I will add a shit ton of jam and that will be great. Well, it's not that bad. I was just hoping for some sort of taste flavor another recipe testing it literally doesn't look that good in the camera but it looks too good to eat it literally i was editing this vlog and i realized that basically all my talking uh, <laughs> talking uh, clips i mean wearing this shirt literally in all my clips but the recipe probably will be on in my instagram by the time this video is posted oh my god oh my god this tastes so good. So those were kind of the most interesting moments of my week. I've been working there for three days. I officially got the job at my favorite restaurant. It's been going pretty great in the way I, yes, I feel tired at the end of the day because I've been in my legs all day long, but the time goes so fast. Food is amazing and I try my best because I'm learning at everything because I don't know where things are, like, I don't know. But kind of been getting used to this situation. So yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this video. Like, subscribe, and see you in the next one. Bye.